Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel The Coach Studio. So, today's widget of the day is Quick Actions. Well, you might have seen this widget when you have long pressed an applications icon and the options you are getting. Those options are known as Quick Actions. Now, with the help of this Quick Action plugin, you can define shortcuts to perform specific actions in your app. These shortcuts can be displayed in a supported launcher and help your users quickly to start some common or recommended tasks within your application. Now, the term for the quick actions in Android is a application shortcut or app shortcut and in iOS, it is known as home screen quick actions. Now, let us see how to implement this package in our Flutter project. So first, import this quick actions plugin inside your pops by camel. Okay, now after importing this, you have to import this library quick actions in your main.dart file. Now here, we have created one class named my homepage. So in its void init method, first we have to initialize the library early in your application's lifecycle by providing a callback, which is Quick action dot initialize, so which will then be called whenever the user launches the app via a quick action. Now here, as you can see, we are having a variable string shortcut, okay, which is now stating no action set. So as you can see on my screen, that in our app also the title bar is having the same variable. So after initializing this, you have to write the syntax in such manner which is quick actions over here and quick action dot initialize here we have to pass the type of the action okay so which is a string so here we will be setting the state so if our shortcut type string is not null then we will set the state of this shortcut type in our shortcut variable which is by default set to no action set value now after this we will set some shortcut items for our quick actions which are in a list so here we will write quick action dot set shortcut items and will pass the type shortcut item now here we are having three types of quick action first place inside our shortcut item there are three parameters first is the type okay now please note that the type argument should be unique within your app among all the register shortcut items okay now this second is localized title. The title that you want to see or that you want to show the user when they long press the your application icon and the name of that task. Okay. And the third is icon. Okay. So this icon should be the name of the native resources. Okay. So for Android, it is uh, the name of the icon which are in your drawable folder. And for iOS, it should be the name of the image which are in your XC assets folder. Okay, so that the app will display to quick action. So here we are having three items. First is notification, second is share, third is message. Now let me show you where are my drawable folders. Okay, so open your project and inside your Android, open app. In that app, go for main. And inside this main folder, we will find a resource folder. Okay. And in this resources, we'll get a drawable folder. Now I have kept all the three images that I want for my quick actions. I've stored it them over here. Okay. So now whenever the user will select any quick action, then its name, as you can see, its type name will be set to our shortcut string and that will be visible in our text as app bar title okay so as you can see now when we will open our app here as you can see this flutter tutorial app so when i will long press on it as you can see it is showing me my quick actions first is message second is share and third is notification so if i select on share so now the title of my app bar is having the type which is share. So that's all for today and if you find this tutorial informative and helpful then please do like and subscribe our channel and 
Thanks for watching and keep fluttering.